It is day 209. Filming myself for no reason. Yesterday at work, I did the really, really boring county county job. It's not even the county county job. Uh, that's that is boring, but it's the more boring job. It's take out cardboard box, put in black box. That's it. That's all I did all night, one after another. And that's not really building the guns. And I'm all about the guns now. The gun show. That my my swans. They're sick. All right, get me a vet. Get me to the veterinarians. All right. Well, you don't really get that from uh, put that in there. It's not. It's not. It's not all that. Oh, yesterday at work they made pizza in the canteen. Pizza. You can go and get a, a pizza at that place. It's only a seven inch, seven inch margarita. But uh, yeah, I was well chuffed about. It. I, I did ever even knew you could buy a pizza. Comes in a little box and everything. It feels really authentic because you get the pizza box a lot. It's good stuff. Good stuff. Today isn't a day off. I'm back at work later on, so I, I need to make a plan. A plan. What am I doing today? What am I doing? Well, someone's revealed a secret. A secret, I hear you ask. Why are you in your car, Chris? Why? Well, I'm, I'm not travelling to the secret. Oh, no, no, no. People might think that's what I'm doing. Going to the land of the secrets. No. I'm not going to the land of the secrets. The secret is confined to the cockpit uh, cock, uh, of my car. And he says to me, he says, do you know the secret compartment in your car? He says, what do you mean, the secret compartment? He says, the secret, um, the secret compartment. No, no, what do you mean? What do you mean, secret compartment? He goes, look under your seat. I'm like, what? No, no. He says, do this. Under the passenger seat in Fiat 500s, there's a little cupboard. A little cubby hole. What is that about? I lied. Um, a USB cable, a pen. God, no one knows I'll have a USB cable and a pen. No one will know. Well, I'm in my car. I might as well go and get a coffee. Might as well. Hear me roar. Of course, it's McDonald. Of course, of course, of course. And the drive through is absolutely ramo, so I'm gonna have to walk inside because I don't want to wait three hours in a drive through. Coffee, 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 coffee. Me, fool me, fool me, fool me. Oh, yeah, but I'm busy. Can't believe how busy the drive through was. Are people scared to go outside and walk into a restaurant and grab a food and go? You're all breathing out and in and in and out without a mask on at the drive through window. You go out the window and you go, can I get, you've breathed in all those other people's germs. I know you're outside and they've probably wafted, but still, just as bad, just as bad. Why is it cute, Roger, to go inside? It's quite faster, it's so much faster to just go into the restaurant and get what you want. I, I just park up, go and grab it, and then I could see the car that was two cars, like, in front of me, just getting an order placed. Ah, I'm not about that life. Just give me my coffee and go. Although when I was in McDonald's, there was some. Uh, how do I say this politically correctly? Not to write. I recognised it actually from back in my retail days. Just staring at me. I was like, oh, oh, what is he? What do you want? What do you want? Why you look at me? But just staring. I could feel it. Oh, oh. That's what life must be like as a pretty girl. I know because it's. I live it every day. Give me that sparkling water. Give me that water. That sparkling water. I need my water to shimmer. Shimmer and shine. Are you chilling out on my window ledge again? You love the window ledge. Why do you like sitting here so much? Hmm? Because you're security. Security detail. Checking the savannah. It's big brain in the big room. The big front room for the big brain. Space for that big brain. Cause I keep the big brain in here, but I can keep it in here because it's big. That's the room and the brain, both of them. Huge. Big brain. I've just seen uh, something online. There's a secret button on your iPhone. A secret button. The back of your iPhone is a giant touch sensitive secret button. And how do you work it? I'll show you how I work it because I've just read the website that showed you how to work it. And I thought to myself, content. Get on your phone and you go to settings. Scroll all the way down to accessibility, and then you go to touch, go to back tap, this is a real thing, and you can choose like double tap, what you want that to do, so let's say I want it to go home, and then if I, uh... yeah, there you go, see that, it went home, I double tapped and it went home. And um, what's that all down with sparkling water? That's very hard to do. Three of them at once. <laughs> I 
treat myself to a shower. I deserved it. I deserve hot water to run down my face. I deserve that. So I'm a shower. I've got my sports uniform on in preparation for activities at work. Fingers crossed I'm doing something a bit more physical today than... Because, I mean, that's great. Great if you're waving somebody off. Or, or maybe you've dropped one and you don't want anyone to know. Great active, great, great physical activity that for that for those purposes. But getting these, it's not. I want to pick the things up. I want to jump around. I want to shout every day. Come and, I don't want to be a, a, a <laughs> whatever they were called. No, I, I was. I, but I want to do something strong and active at work today. So if I believe in myself, I will do strong active work today and wear the sports uniform. It will happen. It will. As you can see, I've adorned the hoodie. It's time to go to work. Hi, Vince has bought me a mile off. Who's that guy? It's Chris. He's wearing a hoodie, obviously. It's orange. Anyway, uh, I'm going to set up for work, but I need to um, defog my car. So, bye!